In lecture, I am going to discuss what how to import JSON data files in Power BI. So here, first I am going to the so file that I am going to import. So this is the film. Now if I right click on the properties, then you can see here or uh, .json. So this is the JSON file is there. And now I am going to show the data inside the file. So this is the data inside the file. Okay. So this uh, uh, files I'm going to import inside to Power BI. So here you can see uh, this is the get data option, and here you cannot see uh, JSON. Then you can click on this more. So thereafter you can get here uh, XML text CSV. So let's uh, select here JSON, click on this connect and to select the file from here. So on the desktop, there I'm going to select here film. So this is uh, connecting right now and uh, it's uh, loading inside the Power BI. So now we have the option connection string you can use this two options so this is a direct this is the import so first option that going to select click on this ok then here power or query editor that's open so now you can see the records inside there so from uh, this place you can remove some rows add some rows to some multiple operation there so here i don't want uh, this uh, columns so here selected this columns now thereafter here you can see or uh, remove uh, columns option click there then here id comes there and this is the data inside there okay and uh, after that the next is here let's close that this one or uh, do you want to apply the changes click on yes okay and now this is uh, loading inside to after doing the changes this is loading into power bi desktop so this is the uh, loading mode and this is the thousand rows data inside there now after that here you can see this uh, films that's come there and now you can see the uh, this all and here you can select uh, uh, film id language and uh, last update date render duration date now thereafter the next is you can increase the size and here you can see this all details okay and this is the sum sum and rental and this all values is there so here you can select this uh, graphical form and this is here chart forms and this is here this forms okay after the after importing json files you can do some multiple operation there so this is the way we can import a json file inside the power bi so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now this video is over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you